Okay, here we go. Color control, Servo GX. The color control is kind of being uh, out, outsold now by the Servo GX, but uh, we won't, I won't go into that. I'm not really into a comparison video at the moment. I want to show you how you can use a Wi Fi hotspot to connect to the color control that doesn't have Wi Fi. So there's a lot of units like the um, Easy Solar 24. 3000 unit that Victron has, which still has the color control in it, does not have Wi Fi. And it can be a bit of a trap if you've been putting in the 48 GX2 Easy Solar with Wi Fi. It's got a little Wi Fi unit. Same with the Servo GX, has a tiny little Wi Fi there in it, um, which is really, really handy. Um, with the color control, you actually need to put in a, a um, USB Wi Fi dongle. So, the reason I'm doing this is because what we need to look at is how to get Wi-Fi onto this to set it up. Because if you can get this onto the VRM portal while you're out in the middle of the sticks and you've got no internet access and no Ethernet port, well, this is what you do. You're going to use your iPhone or your phone. So you want a phone with a hotspot on it and you want an Ethernet lead. So you want an Ethernet cable to connect from this. And you also need a laptop as your go-between. So you're going to use your laptop as your, um, to connect to your Wi-Fi hotspot on your phone, laptop to your phone, and then that will give you internet access to the laptop. And then you're going to bridge the Windows connections and use the ethernet from the laptop to go to the ethernet port of the color control. So the question is, how do you bridge your internet, uh, your Windows connections? So I'm going to share the screen here I am sharing a screen and I'm going to go down to the bottom of the screen. You can see here, internet access, right click on that, click on open network and internet settings. And scroll down to change adapter options. Click on that, we'll bring up another window. And what you want to do is left click once on ethernet left hold the control down the control key left click on that so you've got both of them highlighted let go of the control key and then right click click bridge connections and windows will bridge those two connections and you're done you can now get your hotspot to talk to the color control all right i hope you enjoyed that see you later